holiday illnesses, including flu, COVID, and RSV, could see a spike. All of this according to doctors. Is the season. Mm -hmm. Stephanie Haynes is joining us live this morning with more. Stephanie. Hey, good morning. The CDC says the worst of the respiratory illness season is yet to come. Even though the activity levels are lower at this time than they were last year, they are still on the rise. And there are some indications that RSV may have peaked, but that activity is still high. And it really depends on where you live. Just take a look at this map the CDC provided of, you know, how many states, which states are seeing the highest activity levels. Now it's mostly concentrated across the south and west states. But if you're in Montana, Nebraska, Vermont, West Virginia, you're seeing lower levels, of course, that could change. The latest CDC data shows during the week of December 23rd, close to 30,000 people were admitted to the hospital for COVID. That's the highest since last January. And then 14,000 went to the hospital for flu. And the CDC says vaccination rates among Americans are low. And so that could possibly contribute to more severe, severe illness and possibly more hospitalizations. The CDC is also keeping track of all the new COVID variants particularly JN1, which it says isn't any riskier than any of the other variants and all the mitigation factors like vaccines and antivirals still work against it. But they always say, listen, if you haven't been vaccinated yet and you still kind of want to, never too late. You still have time. Marky, yeah, Adrian. a good warning for families and parents this morning who are certainly uh, listening and keeping their family and, and children's health in mind. Stephanie Haynes, thanks. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.